thinking of London, I bet you're thinking of bustling streets, iconic landmarks, and I doubt you're thinking of Hayes. This is Stone 5 London. It's a bit derelict and a bit dull. But right in the middle of it, out of nowhere, stands a nine-foot dog with quite a spectacular story behind it. Meet Nipper, the beloved pet of Mark Henry Barrard, who spent his life trotting around nipping the ankles of unsuspecting people. But his life took a tragic turn when his owner died at the young age of 38, and he was left in temporary residence with Francis Barrard, Mark's younger brother, before living out the rest of his days with Mark's family in Kingston upon Thames. However, Nipper's life was really basic, and his legacy was yet to come. In 1898, Francis Barrard painted his master's voice, which depicted Nipper listening to a wind-up Edison Bell phonograph. Now, unfortunately, his master's voice did not sell easily, until eventually William Barry Owen brought it. It was William Barry Owen who founded a gramophone company, right in the middle of the marketing revolution. And it might be because of this that he brought his master's voice and its copyright for £100. The gramophone company continued to grow, building a 17-acre factory right here in Hayes. At his iconic spot, finals were produced to be shipped worldwide, and all of them had one little thing in common, the image of a dog. The gramophone company later formed His Master's Voice, a company whose entire identity was based on Nipper. Nipper is still the mascot of HMV, however the final factory has seen better days. It is currently undergoing a £250 million renovation, as the world moved on from records a long time ago. Though many believe renovating a factory will destroy the town's historic culture, many residents are excited by the hundreds of new homes, jobs and world-class facilities it will provide, which when combined with the new Elizabeth line running alongside it, can only mean a brighter future for Hayes. In tribute of the final factory, the site is scattered with Easter eggs, ranging from building names to street names. But maybe the most meaningful one is Nipper, the dog who starts it all, who now stands here as a reminder of a bygone era and a symbolic love between owners and their pets. 